Welcome back to Mass Effect. We're in the middle of the Leviathan DLC. In my quarters. So I've heard someone wants to come up here. James, I've got some time if you want to talk privately. On my way. I have to teach him how to do a full Nelson. Hey man. Next time. Going? Good, James. You? Good, good. Love the background music. Wow. So this is what I can look forward to when I get my own command. You want your own ship, Vega? Yeah, maybe one day. When I'm old and I can't fight worth shit anymore. <laughs> you just come up here to make fun of your commander? Sorry, Shepard. I guess... Maybe I got some things on my mind. I, I wanted to get your opinion on something. Shoot. What did you do when they asked you to join the N7 program? I mean, was it a no-brainer for you, or did you think about it before accepting? First of all, I need some background music. Oh, in the last scenes here, they had background music. This time they're like, mm-mm, nah, don't want that. Oh, ambience, let's go with Callisto. Don't hear anything yet. It's... There we go. No brain up. I'm a soldier, Vega. And I wanted to be the best damn soldier I could be. It doesn't get better than N7. So I hear. You get the best training, best equipment, best assignments. And they expect the best in return. Yes, they do. Why are you asking? Well. Even all the shit that's going on, somebody, somewhere, managed to track me down and forward an N7 commendation. It's dated the same day the Reapers attacked Earth. You don't sound too thrilled. Well, aside from the fact that there won't be an N7 program if we don't win this war, I just... Being a soldier's the only thing I've ever been really good at. And not because I try. I allowed to kick my ass out years ago. Last time I had a command, I lost almost everyone. And they promoted me for it. I guess I'm just not sure if I'm ready to lead again. I don't know if I want that responsibility. You mentioned that before. What went wrong? What didn't go wrong? We were out on patrol, checking on some strange readings, and the collectors hit. But they hit the colony first. By the time we got back, most of the colonists had been subdued or abducted, including our CO, Captain Tony. So you were in charge? Yeah. We laid low for a bit, waiting for a chance to strike, but before we could, we were betrayed. One of the colonists turned out to be a Cerberus spy working with the Collectors. I had no choice. I killed him and destroyed the Collector ship. But it got ugly. We lost most of the colonists and all but one of my squad. Not exactly a textbook operation. That already makes no sense. Why would a Cerberus operative work with the Collectors while we... A Cerberus dude's dust game tried to hunt down the collectors. Ah, oh. Let's be Paragon for him. As a leader, you've got a job to do. Keeping everyone alive, isn't it? Oof. If you're afraid to send your troops into a do-or-die situation, you'll never succeed. Yeah. Did you know that before you joined the N7? Yeah. That's why I was asked. And it's why they asked you. There's not a single N7 that hasn't sacrificed, either themselves or their soldiers at some point. So you think I should accept? Assuming we survive this, that's a no-brainer. You're a damn good soldier, Vega. Don't waste that opportunity. I'll think about it. Seriously. If you don't mind, maybe don't mention this to anyone else. Of course not. Gracias. Well, I think I better get back to the hangar. Things here are it's a little too soft for me. The bed's a lot harder than it looks. I'll take your word for it. Thanks again, Shepard. Uh -huh. Anytime. That was awkward. That's hell. That's hell. Anybody else want to chat with me? No, good. <laughs> oh. He's already in seven. Apparently. To this mod. I won't take James Vega with me anymore anyways. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I believe I will take Vitaly and Garrus this time. 
since they won't be around for the next let's play. <laughs> oh, saying. Can I go? Thank you. Before bed. Oh, we got two music. It's background. Scan for the Wi Fi. Gotta destroy one of them. You go and play this. Recording device doesn't work that smoothly. Scan for the wire from Psy Phobe. I wanna scan here though first. There are no reapers here, ha. Oh, no they are. Just chill. Much fuel on full. Sigh for bed. Signal confirmed. That's the dog boy. This plant was only spotted recently by human probes. I thought only it didn't have probes. It's a wood arch planet, right? Then we're at the final destination. Good. These coordinates match our trace of Leviathan. Okay, let's go down then. I said, Gurus. And we're gonna bring Tali. Do I only have one modded outfit for her? Yeah. Don't even know. It's not fair. Some people just have endless mods like ED. And some people don't have much. Shotgun, RT radar. I know the pistol is good, that's why I'm taking it. I don't know if the shotgun is good. Matter, oh, it doesn't matter. I wanted to switch out armor piercing. Mm. <coughs> that face doesn't work. It doesn't work. Um, let's give him armor piercing then. Hope to put that on automatically. That seems a little bit high. A little bit like we could have landed inside the planet. But just, you know, flew into Cortez, the atmosphere. What's the status on the probe we launched? Tracking it now, Commander. I've confirmed that Leviathan's signal originates from this planet. Heard how, uh, Anne helped us locate it. It's pretty spooky stuff. Makes you wonder what we're going to find down there. A Reaper killer. That's what Bryson's task force was calling it. Doesn't look like it wants to be found. It doesn't have a choice. We're here. Right. But then what? It plays pretty rough, and if it is a Reaper, I don't know that's the kind of help we want. Exactly. I would have never gone that far. It kills Reapers. When they chase him, why would we chase it? That could just turn it to an enemy of ours. Ah, uh, those both answers are stupid. We're not going to win this war by turning away help, even if it does have blood on its hands. Commander, new readings from the probe. It's narrowed down Leviathan's location. You're not going to like it. Let's hear it. There's nothing but ocean. I show a concentration of structures floating on the surface, but the probe's giving us a signal below that. Way below. Underwater? Looks that way. The shuttle should still be able to reach it. That's possible? The Kodiak is spec to nearly a thousand atmospheres, though I've never actually tested that. Guess we're gonna find out. Status! Some kind of pulse hit us! Systems are shutting down! Brace for impact! Well, of course. That's actually a smooth landing. Not bad. Everyone all right? My suit's intact. Maybe a few bruises under it. How's the shuttle, Cortez? 
Checking now. I'll see if I can get power restored. Copy that. We'll look around. Look at all this. How many have been stranded here by that pulse? Could be Leviathan's last line of defense. This is nice. Wait for shuttle repairs. Get the text off my screen so I can take a screenshot. The previous one I butchered anyways. Ah, oh, does it reshade time? Yeah, sure. Let's test one reshade or two. <laughs> oh, ignore the spinning. It's part of it. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah. This looks good. This looks perfect for the water planet. I played a game earlier last year called Death in the Water 2, where you hunt sharks and stuff, underwater stuff. And I guess this 3D reshade works good with water. And water worlds, one more. Oh, god damn. No. Stones. Too much spinning. Oh. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this also works good with everything, it's very heavy on the blue side, but still works too. Okay, we're going back. Those are the two best reshades in my opinion. God damn. Look even better than what I'm seeing right here. This one. I recognize a few of these ships, but only from historical records. They're ancient. Mm. This fight will be tough. I hope that shotgun is worth it. Any idea how old these are? At CSAC, they always said the key to decomposition was scattered. Shepard, we got one of those artifacts. We shoot it. Explains why no one gets out of here. We can shoot it. Now, if they tell me there's a captain, you need to go deep underwater to find that Leviathan creature. But going deep under the water is pretty much suicide because the machine we're going under with won't survive that easily. <laughs> I would be like, no, oh, I'm worth it. I won't sacrifice my reaper, my reaper killing life for a reaper killer who kills reapers anyways if they chase him. I wouldn't sacrifice that. That's why I feel like this still is kind of stupid. This thing. That's the thing we're gonna use. Looks like a damage. Look! We've got company, Shepard. Must have been right behind us. Protect That's a the big shuttle. boy. Where's the Among Us Reaper? Right! On the double! Um, no. Uh, is that energy drain? Yes. Cortez! Situation! Swapping out the po- Arch Commander, hang on! Oh, boy. in the water. Shit. That's not that good. I'm pretty dead. That's not that good. I'm screwed. That's not. That's not what I need on this mission. Again, that's not that good. Gotta get super close with this bad boy. It's like a weaker claymore. It kills us at least. What happened? Almost there. Out of development, Commander. Fixing it now. 
Like, look. Didn't die. No, no range. No range. Freeze. God damn. Should throw in some mats. Cortez, I need that bird in the air. Just a few seconds. Torch, Gyrus. Damn it, throw on that stuff. Too late for Garrus to get some cover fire. He's getting shredded. Copy that. Well, oh, that's bad. Oh, fuck. Tell me. Nope, can't revive him. Oh. Damn, Garris. Still need you. Come down and shoot immediately. I apparently can still use his effect still. Oh, he's back. What a surprise. A weapon dart. A weapon dart surprise. Focus. Need to focus. Damn, <laughs> Damn it. Get to him. Oh. Oh, that's shockwave. Good. Commander, I've got enemy contact. Under fire. Under pressure. Oof. There's so much over there. It's gonna be insane. Gonna do it. It matters so much if the time that right. Okay, we're clear. We have nice just work, a Commander. second of stutter. We need to talk. Just just one second of stutter, you're so screwed. I guess we can't get off the planet. Many stutters with Wenger Church screw you so much. And that's why I won't play Wenger Church again. And in the next playthrough. This is gonna be brutal. Sane even. Hydra. Oh, one rocket launcher. Do I get that when I switch through? Ah, just drop it. Status. Shuttle's a mess, Commander. That pulse knocked it right out of the air. We're not going anywhere. Can the Normandy extract us? Same thing would happen to her. And the landing won't be as pretty. I'd say Leviathan has some sort of defense system in place. And then there are the Reapers. That's a shotgun. Then we aren't getting out of here until we find it. So how do we do that? Well... You might be able to use a mech. Looks like it's rigged for diving. Oh god damn, I hate that. That's stupid. 19 minutes. Good. Got one hour again. A diving mech? 
It's a Triton model. Military grade, repurposed for deep sea exploration. As long as the seawater hasn't corroded it, you should be good to go. To be honest, I would send Cortez down there. <laughs> As a captain. I don't know how to drive things like that. That's your truck, Cortez. Get in there. You got this. Don't let the Leviathan brainwash you. I'm game. We chased Leviathan this far. Let's finish this. It's a long ways down. Not gonna sugarcoat it. I hear you. Time's wasted. Hold on a second. Are we actually considering... First, we'll need to restore power to get that cargo door open. How? I guess we are. These old Ballard-class ships are equipped with exterior power sockets. They use them for emergency repairs. We can strip the cells from the shuttle and use those for juice. Hang on, I'll get you started. You got a cell for you, Commander. Find somewhere to plug that in. What's my PC? Damn. Oh. oh yeah, I remember. The hell was that? Okay, double dab it. Got it. Another power cell for you, Commander. Never a dull moment. Grab another cell, Shepard. We'll hold them all. Off the voice. Ah, fuck. No, oh, hope his armor breaker is on. Armor breaker. That pistol is good, though. I upgraded it a little bit. Oh. And Garrus is dead. Armor breaker. You got this tally. Tank for me, baby. Yeah, shotgun has no range. Is that? Salvage equipment. Hey, tally survived. Good job. And I got a fast way back. Paris is up again. There's ammo. Give me. Pop on breaker. Let's run for it. Put it in. And wait for the benches. Good. Oh no. That's not good. Not good. Not good at all. And Cortez just sitting there with his power cell in hand. Now those bastards can fall on you and damage you. Get into the eight. Get to that mech, Commander. We could use the help. I like being in one of those. That's actually cool stuff. Oh, made it. Just like in Jack's mission. No, you should have shot the brute. Got it, right. Great one. Someone is down again. This time it's Tali. Ooh, snapped it. No bench is sighting so far, which is always good. That did it. Looks like we're in the clear now, Commander. 
Good. I need to get in the water before they come back. Roger that. Walk the mech back to me when you're ready to dive. I should check it over first. I want to put that rigid on. I want to see a spin out. Yep, totally spinning out. I'm still going to put that rigid on. It's going to be weird. Text ain't gonna look good. It's still love all it. Right, Commander. Let's get you out of stuff. Do a systems check. Listen, Shepard. I'm all for crazy ideas, but this one's off the charts. We've come too far to stop now. The way home is through Leviathan. Okay, seals, check out. Oxygen pressure is nominal. Systems are a go. It's as ready as I can make it. Ah, oh, we ready, right? Twenty-five minutes. That's gonna. Take 10 minutes at cutscenes. My reshade is working for the underwater stuff. Text is kind of glitchy, but it looks good underwater. I promise. I'm ready. Let's go. Take care down there, Commander. Unless my package Closing comes. Edge. Unless my package comes while I'm having that cutscene. Engaging systems. Ready. Testing comm link. I read you. Here goes. It already looks good. Let's dive in three, two, one. The music would be nice now. Shoot holding up, Commander. Looks good so far. Good. I'm getting some common interference on the second half. Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Imagine that, how oh, the legendary Commander Shepard dies. Just starving and floating down to the ocean. Going on to a schnitzel yacht. On the water dive. Can't you go? Oh, you actually walk down there, I believe. Which means I can sh switch through reshade mods again. I remember correctly, it might be timed, so I don't got the chance, we'll see. Oh, I love the reshade for underwater stuff, got a link death in the water with reshade mods. I did that one without commentary, it was right in my Wisdom 2 for Operation face. Gotta revisit that game. Not sure if you can read me up there. Looks like I finished the major descent. Can't see much from here. Suit is holding up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operational. I'm gonna take a reshade break here in a second. Check out no reshade mods. Uh, is that a good view? Scanner indicates the probe is below my position. Looking for a way down. Oh no, this looks almost too trippy cool. Okay, let's try it. Get ready for the spinning. And me one, that's the one I use all the time. And it looks good here, but off. Oh, on the water stuff so sexy okay and dying light photorealism and one vibrant one this is like i said so blue heavy that it's almost too much it's too dark and see stuff oh the spinning with vibrance vibrance is extreme colorful almost too much that's why it's not that good. Back to 3D. Good. Let's keep it. I love the visuals of that down here. And it jumped down, right? Yes. <coughs> Shutting That's down not... all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Can't worry about that, that now. That... There's my ambience. 
getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. Might have to turn the voices and effects down and just sit there for the ambience. Um, this is good down here. I think it's safe actually, right? No. No, I can't. Reading the probe directly below me. Looks like the final drop. Oh, yeah. You know what? Now I'm gonna cut it here and record the ambience for a bit. Okay, I'm ready for the jump. No, actually, let's check. I'm recording good. The reshade loading is <laughs> so weird. But it looks so good underwater. Can't see anything just yet. Yeah, that looks good. I almost want to do the whole suicide. No, suicide. What a mission again, just for the music. And stand <clears throat> and stop at every drop. Found the probe. Seems intact. I'm gonna keep moving. Find Leviathan. Might do that in the evening. Just doing this again. We record it with music. is that? Ah, oh, the segment is already over, isn't it? happening your memories give voice to our words your nature will be revealed to us except this you took down a reaper you could help us win this war why the hell are you hiding down here there is no war there is only the harvest then help us stop it none have possessed the strength in past cycles your own species could be destroyed with a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. Our kind was the apex of life in the galaxy. The lesser species were in our thrall, serving our needs. We grew more powerful than they were cared for, but we could not protect them from themselves. Over time, the species built machines that then destroyed them. Tribute does not flow from a dead race. To solve this problem, we created an intelligent 
intelligence with a mandate to preserve life at any cost. As the intelligence evolved, it studied the development of civilizations. Its understanding grew until it found a solution. In that instant, it betrayed us. It chose our kind as the first harvest. From our essence, the first reaper was created. You call it Harbinger. And Dustin from Dawn begins. Uh, so, what version they created the Reaper machines, the AI, and the AI turned on them, realizing the only way to preserve the galaxy is by destroying the organic life forms because they would harvest the goddamn universe to death. You built that machine despite what you saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. And now we all pay the price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. How did you remain hidden all this time? Our extermination was not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the Thrall races were controlled, removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out through the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle for the safety of this world. Through them, we watch, we study, and remain in the shadows. How did the intelligence defeat you? To find a solution, it required information. Physical data drawn from organic life in the cosmos. It created an army of pawns that searched the galaxy, gathering this data. There was no warning. No reason given when they turned against us. Only slaughter. Only the harvest. Tell me about the Reapers. Each harvest ends with the birth of a Reaper. Perfect in its design. Each formed in Harbinger's image. Our image. Each Reaper has the power to influence organics. Over countless cycles, this ability was refined, perfected, and gave rise to indoctrination. What's the point of all these harvests? The intelligence has one purpose. Preservation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. It directed the Reapers to create the mass relays to speed the time between cycles for greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. What do you know about the Crucible? We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No! You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. Will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. If you release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. The Reapers know where you are. You can't just watch anymore. You have to fight. 
Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this, once and for all. I've earned it. Out there fighting, where you should be. It is clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. Your victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We were the first, the Apex race. We will survive. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. They will become our slaves. Today, they pay their tribute in blood. Rosters activated. God, I wish I could take screenshots in the app. Nope. Not a thing. Also need to switch reshades back to normal. Otherwise it's too trippy. Curious. Run. Get me out of here. Shepard's back. Cortez, talk to me. We're good to go. I don't know what the commander did, but the pulse is offline. <laughs> oh, that little husk. I don't know why the music is gone. Damn it, we got a Reaper inbound! Control it. Not a Reaper Shepherd killed on its own. Oh, help from others. Shepherd, wake up! He's freezing! <coughs> you okay? <coughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Hell of a headache. We're lucky we got you back. How did it go down there? We found it. It's real. And a lot more than we ever imagined. So was it worth almost dying for? Reshit change. Oh, it doesn't spin around. That's a nice change too. Lightning. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. But we proved it can't hide anymore. That it's a part of this war. Just like us. And it's gonna help fight. That's amazing. Yeah. One for the history books. Still gotta look for a better Tali retexture. Maybe Rester I can get one. Report. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. 
Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a Bye. big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. Aye, aye, sir. Let's see how much that thing is worth. 400. All right, that's worth a lot. That's actually worth... Wait, they will fight this liquid assets. That's more worth than one grunt. Okay, the lions has a lot. How much is Samara worth? 25 probably here. Who the hell was that? Where's Tali? Oh, Legion. Yeah, Tali. I gotta have to find a new face mod for you. I haven't heard any news about that Reaper base. Hopefully they'll give us a target soon. No. Talk to you later, Tally. Already sure. talked to you. She has a normal face here. It's a weird cat face. Okay, that one too. That one too, I guess Arius too sees next. I gotta save here. And I wanna go down on that planet again to record the ambience. That stuff was cool. Anything? I'm pretty sure Choke has something to say at least. Or trainer. Commander? Commander? Nope. God, did the ship ambience music so badly? Should have a default ambience for everywhere where there's no music currently. Man, those Quarian admirals are intimidating. And if what? you get nervous, you can't even imagine them naked because, like, who knows? Is that tentacle monster under there? What is that? What's under there? Commander? Commander? Nobody has to say anything about the live fire fans. So the Reapers did not fully exterminate their creators. Oh. That suggests they are fallible, even on large or long-term scales. Thank you, Edie. The VIP of this DLC. Ah, oh, Shift took me out with me the next time. Shepard, you are staring. <laughs> wow. Hello, Shepard. How did you know? Hello, Shepard. That's the first time I've heard that. Oh, uh, it's funny they put that in. That annoys you that I'm staring at my ship. It's my ship after all. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, okay. Done here. Guess we can switch outfit. Ah, oh, there's so many outfits that are cool looking, but have legs on them. We can't have that armor with legs. It's a no-go. Like, I played with most of them already. This Andromeda set. Something I would love to play again, but... Too many legs. Too many legs. Especially the remnant. Sadly, we can't get rid of the legs here, right? We can just switch that out. Oh, and the scenario won't work. Yeah, this icon is cool too. But we already dedicated to the luckless Commander Shepard. No turning back now. You actually I wanted to save that outfit too. Sure. Sure, now okay, we're done. Peace out.